You are headed out and about and you're traveling at all. You're not going to have a whole lot of in, uh, a lot of weather impeding you. You look at the metro right now just off to the northwest, a few scattered showers. Rest has pushed uh, well off to the north, but up near Fort Dodge had some heavier showers pushed through there. So these will continue to transition northward throughout the rest of the evening. And you can see there's just not a lot in the pipeline behind that. Could see a little bit of light rain through the southeastern portion of the state overnight. But for now, you look out downtown and it's looking pretty good. 47 degrees, fairly mild for this time of year. We've got some clouds, but the rain stopped falling throughout the metro. Temperatures across the state range quite a bit. 35 for Sioux City, 50 in Iowa City. And again, those spots off to the northwest have already seen a little bit of snow out there. But no snow in our forecast, at least for the next 12 hours or so. You look ahead at the morning hours and temperatures dial back into the upper 30s to low 40s. I think we notch a low of 37 somewhere in that time frame. That's because on the back side of the system, winds will be punching down from the northwest. So drive in a little bit of cooler air. But importantly, though, that rain finally does skedaddle on out of here. And as it does so, it will leave a few clouds behind. You can see that mess of rain off to the southeast. Atumwa, you're included in that. Atumwa, I'd say southeast, perhaps as far northwest as Knoxville, though. Uh, clouds begin to clear out by the afternoon hours, and we work in a bit of sunshine. So a beautiful Easter holiday. And even as we start our work week, it's looking like skies will be clear. Temperatures on Monday warming up into the mid-60s. So not only do we get the sunshine, but we get the incredible warmth to go along with that. Tonight, though, still a few lingering showers. 37 degrees, your overnight low. Tomorrow, temperatures back up into the low 50s. And remember, we start off the day with some clouds. And if you're off to the southeast, you'll start off with some showers. Uh, those will clear out by the afternoon hours. So we continue to look at an absolutely beautiful day. Low 50s through the central portion of the state. Southwest, you'll get rid of those clouds a little bit sooner than the rest of us as that system pushes off to the east. Northwest, you're included in that 51 for Pocahontas, 51 for Carroll. Jefferson coming in at 53 for a high. Upper 40s to low 50s if you're in northeastern Iowa. Uh, Eldora at 51, 50 for Toledo as well. And those off to the southeast, Knoxville, 53 degrees, likely hanging out of that, that cloud cover and chances for rain a little bit longer than the rest of us. But good news, 64 on Monday with that sunshine. We hang on to the 60s on Tuesdays. We climb to 65 with partly cloudy skies. Showers and perhaps strong thunderstorms return on Wednesday with a high of 70. After that, temperatures taper back greatly by the end of next weekend to 39 degrees.